Barley. Barley. B A R L E Y. Barley. Bevel. Can you please repeat the word? Bevel. Bevel. Hey, one more time. Bevel. Bevel. <coughs> Bevel. B E V E L E. Bevel. That's incorrect. The correct spelling is B E V E L. Excuse me? Polka. Say it one more time, please. Polka. Polka. P O L K A. Polka. Sumo. Sumo. S U M O. Miso. Miso. M I S O. Miso. Errand. Errand. E R R A N D. Errand. Nosh. Nosh. N O S H. Nosh. Ambulance. Ambulance. A M B U L A N C E. Ambulance. Bandersnatch. Bandersnatch. B A N D E R S N A T C H. Bandersnatch. Powwow. Powwow. P O W O W. Powwow. The correct pronunciation is P O W W O W. <coughs> Manicure. Manicure. M A N I C U R E. Manicure. Fiesta. Fiesta, F-I-E-S-T-A, Fiesta. Broadleaf. Broadleaf, can I have a definition please? Certainly. A tree of Jamaica whose wood is used for boards, small pieces of lumber, shingles, and staves. Can I have a language of origin please? This word consists of two originally English elements. Broadleaf. B R O A D L E A F broadleaf. Dracula. Dracula. D R A C U L A. Dracula. Denim. Denim. D E N I M. Denim. Orchard. Orchard. O R C H A R D. Orchard. Jaguar. Jaguar. J A G U A R. Jaguar. Newton. Can you repeat that, please? Newton. Uh, where does it come from, please? This word is from an English name. Newton. N-E-W-T-O-N. -E Newton.
ventilate. Could you repeat the word, please? Ventilate. Ventilate. V E N T I L A T E. Ventilate. Sonata. Um, can I read that, please? Sonata. S. Sonata. S O N A T A. Sonata. Aquatic. Aquatic. A Q U A T I C. Aquatic. Sitzmark. You repeat the word. Sitzmark. I have the definition, please. Certainly. A depression left in the snow by a skier falling backward. I have the word one more time, please. Sitzmark. S-I-T-S-M-A-R-K. Sitzmark. The correct spelling is S-I-T-Z-M-A-R-K. Mathematics. Mathematics. M A T H E M A T I C S. Mathematics. Threshold. Threshold. T H R E S H O L. D, threshold. Cockatoo. Cockatoo, C-O-C-K-A-T-O-O, -O. cockatoo. Lunatic. Lunatic, L-U-N-A-T-I-C, lunatic. Hyphen. Hyphen. H Y P H O N. The correct spelling is H Y P H E N. Nightingale. Could I have the definition, please? Certainly. A thrush common in Great Britain that is noted for the sweet song of the male often heard at night during the breeding season. Can you repeat the word? Nightingale. N-I-G-H-T-I-N-G-A-L-E. Nightingale. Maraca. Maraca. M A R R A C A. The correct spelling is M A R A C A. Hibachi. Hibachi. H I B A C H I. Periscope. Periscope. P A R A S C O P E. Periscope. The correct spelling is P E R I S C O P E. Knavery. Knavery. K N A V E R Y. Knavery. Slaughter. Slaughter. S L A G H T E R. 
The correct spelling is S-L-A-U-G-H-T-E-R. Fatigue. Fatigue. F-A-T-I-G-U-E. Fatigue. Begonia. Begonia. B-E-G-O-N-I-A. Begonia. Islamic. Islamic. I-S-L-A-M-I-C. Islamic. Malaria. Malaria. M A L A R I A Good morning. Pandit. Pandit. Definition, please. Certainly. A Brahmin expert in Sanskrit and in the science, laws, and religion of the Hindus. So I'm guessing that this word comes from Indian? In Hindi? All right, Pandit. P A N D I T, Pandit. Graffiti. Graffiti. G R A F F I T E, Graffiti. The correct spelling is G R A F F I T I. Haiku. Haiku? Can you give me the definition, please? Certainly. An unrhymed verse form of Japanese origin having three lines containing usually five, seven, and five syllables, respectively, referring in some way to one of the seasons of the year. Haiku. H A I. K U haiku. Crusoe. Crusoe. C R U S O. Crusoe. The correct spelling is C R U S O E. Apathy. Can you give me the definition? Certainly. Absence or lack of interest or concern. Listlessness. Indifference. Language of origin? This word is from Greek. Apathy. A. P P A T H Y. The correct spelling is A P A T H Y. Chalupa. Chalupa. C H A L U P A. Chalupa. Automaton. Language of origin, please. This word is from Greek. Automaton. A U T O M A T O N. Automaton. Portfolio. Portfolio. P O R T F O L I O portfolio anchovy anchovy a n c h o v y anchovy toucan toucan t u c a n toucan the correct spelling is T O U C A N. 
Frankenstein. Frankenstein. <clears throat> F-R-A-K. F-R-A-K-E-N-S-T-E-I-N. Knew it. The correct spelling is F-R-A-N-K-E-N-S-T-E-I-N. Sedilla. Can I have the origin of the word, please? This word is from a word that went from Latin to Spanish. Can I have the word repeated? Sedilla. S or A D I L L A. The correct spelling is C E D I L L A. Contiguous. Contiguous. C O N T I G O U S. Contiguous. The correct spelling is C O N T I G U O U S. And that concludes our first round, I believe. Plausible. Can you repeat the word, please? Plausible. Plausible. P L A. U-S-A-B-L-E, plausible. The correct spelling is P-L-A-U-S-I-B-L-E. Topography. Topography. Language of origin, please. This word is from Greek. Topography. T-O-P-O-G-R-A. P H Y. Caribou. Caribou. C A R I B O U. Caribou. Juggernaut. Juggernaut. J U G G. E-R-N-A-U-T, Juggernaut. Mutable. Can I have a definition, please? Certainly. Open to debate, debatable. It must, I will note, please, that this word could be confused with a similar word. So the definition is open to debate, debatable. And its part of speech is an adjective. Mutable. M O O D A B L. Mutable. The correct spelling is M O O T A B L E. <coughs> Implement. Implement. I M P L E M E N T. Implement. Incorruptible. Incorruptible. I N C O R R U P T I B L E. Incorruptible. Androcentric. Can I get a definition? Certainly. Centering or centered on or in the male, dominated by or emphasizing masculine interests or point of view. Androcentric. A N D R O C N T R I C. Androcentric. The correct spelling is A N D R O C E N T R I C. Xylophone. Xylophone. X Y L O P H O N E, xylophone. Quesadilla. Quesadilla. Q U E S A D I L L A, quesadilla. Acronym. Acronym. Can I have a definition, please? 
Certainly, a word formed from the original initial letter or letters of each of the successive parts or major parts of a compound term. Acronym. A-C-R-O-N-Y-M, acronym. This word could be confused with a similar word. So it's parts of speech, the word itself is periphery. And it's a part of speech, it's a noun, and its definition is surrounding space, an area lying beyond the strict limits of a thing. Periphery, P-E-R-I-P-H-E-R-Y, periphery. Mistletoe. Mistletoe, M-I-S-T-L-E-T-O-E, -E, mistletoe. This word has a homonym. It is a, the word is moly. It is a noun, and it, its definition is a highly spiced sauce made principally of chili and chocolate, but containing numerous other ingredients and served with meat. Moly, M-O-U-L-E, moly. The correct spelling is M-O-L-E. Tortoni. Can I have the word again? Tortoni. Tortoni. T O R T O N I. Tortoni. Spin it. Spin it. Uh, can you repeat that, please? Spin it. Uh, derivation? This word came from Italian, which formed it from a Latin word. Uh, spin it. S-P-I-N-E-T, spin it. Cordovan. Can I have the definition, please? Certainly. A variable color averaging a dark grayish red. Could you repeat the word, please? Cordovan. Can I have the word of origin? This word is from a Spanish geographical name. Could you repeat the word? Cordovan. Cordovan. C-O-U-R-D-I-V-E-N, Cordovan. The correct spelling is C-O-R-D-O-V-A-N. Protagonist. Protagonist. P O R T A G O N I S T. Protagonist. The, pro the correct spelling is P R O T A G O N I S T. Bolero. Bolero. B-O-L-E-R-O, -E Bolero. Piazza. Piazza? What origin is it? The origin, this word came from Italian, which formed it from a Latin word. Piazza? P-I-A-Z-Z-A, -Z -Z -A, Piazza. Nirvana. Nirvana. N I R V A N A. Nirvana. This word could be confused with a similar word. The word is keelhaul. It is a verb, and its definition is rebuke with great severity. Keelhaul. K E E H. A W L Kill. The correct spelling is K E E L H A U L. Sukiyaki. Sukiyaki. 
Can I have the language of origin, please? This word is from Japanese. Can I have the definition, please? Certainly. Meat, soybean curd, onions, bamboo shoots, and other vegetables cooked in a soy sauce, sake, and sugar. Sukiyaki. S U K I A K I Sukiyaki. The correct spelling is S U K I Y A K Y A K I. This word has a homonym, gilder. It is a noun, and its definition is any of various silver coins, especially a a Dutch golden. What's the language of origin? This word is an English modification of a Dutch word. Can you repeat the word, please? Gilder. Can you use it in a sentence, please? The coin collector wanted to find out what the monetary value of his gilder would be if it were adjusted for inflation and converted to euros. G U I L D E R, gilder. Cadenza. Cadenza. C-A-D-E-N-Z-A. Cadenza. Pochismo. Pochismo. P-O-C-H-I-S-M-O. Salmonella. Salmonella. S A L M O N E L L A. Salmonella. Philanthropy. Could you repeat the word? Philanthropy. Philanthropy. P H I L A N T H R O P Y. Philanthropy. Capitulation. Capitulation. Can I have a definition, please? Certainly. The act or agreement of one that surrenders to an enemy upon stipulated terms. Can I have the language of origin, please? This word is from Latin. Capitulation. C-A-P-I-T-U-L-A-T-I-O-N. Capitulation. Meister singer. Meister singer. M E I S T E R. Z I N G E R. The correct spelling is M-E-I-S-T-E-R-S-I-N-G-E-R. Good morning. Erudite. Erudite. Uh, Definition, please. Certainly. Characterized by a love of knowledge for its own sake, devoted to the pursuit of learning. And sentence, please. The speaker's presentation was a compilation of research that would interest only the most erudite scholars of his field. Erudite. E R U D I T E. Erudite. Macrame. Macrame? Can you give me the definition, please? Certainly. 
A coarse lace or decorative fringe made by, an, by knotting threads or cords in a geometrical pattern. Uh, can you give me the language of origin? This word is from a word that went from Arabic to Turkish to either Italian or French before becoming English. Macrame. M-A-C-R-O-M-A-Y. The correct spelling is M-A-C-R-A-M-E. Boudoir. B-O-U-D-O-I-R, boudoir. Hollandaise. Hollandaise. Language of origin, please. This word is from a French geographical name. Hollandaise. H-O-L-L-A-N-D-A-I-S-E. Hollandaise. Bellicose. Bellicose. B E L L I C O S E. Bellicose. Vigilante. Vigilante. V I G I L A N T E. Vigilante. And I believe that concludes our second round. Ostentatious. Ostentatious. Using the sentence, please. Certainly. Mrs. Howell's purchase of a diamond-studded collar for her poodle was one of her many ostentatious extravagances. Ostentatious. A-U-S-T. E-N. T-A-C-I-O-U-S-E. The correct spelling is O-S-T-E-N-T-A-T-I-O-U-S. Arachnid. Arachnid. A-R-A-C-H-N-I-D. Arachnid. Bobka. Can you repeat the word, please? Bobka. Can I have a definition, please? Certainly. A glazed sweetbread made with dried fruit as raisins. Bobka. B O B C A. Bobka. The correct spelling is B A B K A. Azimuth. Asma, is it Arabic? The language of origin, please. The word, this word is from Arabic. Okay, okay. Uh, A Z I M U T H, asthma. Genre. Genre. G E N R E. Genre. Wainscot. Wainscot, W-A-I-N-S-C-O-T, Wainscot. Troika. Troika, T-R-O-I-K-A, Troika. Notochord. Notochord. <coughs> Can I have a definition, please? Certainly. A flexible rod of cells that in the, in the lowest chordates and in the embryos of the higher vertebrates form the supporting axis of the body. Notochord. Uh, can you repeat the word again? Notochord. Notochord. Can you use the word in a sentence, please? 
Sea squirts and acorn worms in the larval stage have a notochord extending from head to tail. Notochord. N-O-T-A-C-H-O-R-D. Notochord. The correct spelling is N-O-T-O-C-H-O-R-D. Glossnost. Glossnost. G-L-O-S-N-O-S-T. The correct spelling is G-L-A-S-N-O-S-T. Perennial. Perennial. Can I have the origin? This word is from Latin. Perennial. P-E-R. E-N. N-I-E-L. Perennial. The correct spelling is P-E-R-E-N-N-I-A-L. This word has a near homonym. Bonsai. It is, a, it is a noun, and its definition is a Japanese cheer, a cry of enthusiasm or triumph, usually used interjectionally. Banzai, B-A-N-Z-A-I, Banzai. Hippopotamus. Hippopotamus, uh, can I have a definition please? Any of various large herbivorous, four-toed, chiefly aquatic mammals with an extremely large head and mouth, bare and very thick skin, and short legs. Can I have derivation? This word is from Greek. Hippopotamus. H-I-P-P-O-P-O-T-A-M-U-S. Hippopotamus. Forsythia. Forsythia. F-O-R-S-Y-T-H-I-A. Forsythia. Infinitesimal. Infinitesimal. I-N-F-I-N-I-T-E-S-I-M-A-L. Infinitesimal. Recidivist. Can you repeat the word, please? Recidivist. Language of origin, please. This word came from French, which formed it from a Latin word. Recidivist. R E C I V I D I S T. Recidivist. The correct spelling is R E C I D I V I S T. Verboten. Can I have the language of origin, please? This word is from an originally German word. Verboten. V E R. B O T E N verboten. Lieutenant. Lieutenant. L I U T E N A N T. Lieutenant. The correct spelling is L I E U T E N A N T. Quizzling. Quizzling? Q U I S L 
I N G. This word has a near homonym, karaoke. It is a noun, and it's a device that plays instrumental accompaniments for a selection of songs to which the user sings along, karaoke. K-A-R-A-O-K-E, karaoke. We're gonna skip this next one. Tertiary. Could you repeat the word? Tertiary. Could I please have the language of origin? This word is from Latin. Tertiary. T-E-R-T-I-A-R-Y, tertiary. Fuselage. Can I have a definition, please? Certainly. The central body portion of an airplane designed to accommodate the crew and the passengers or cargo. Can I have a language of origin, please? This word is from a French word. Fuselage. F-U-S-E-L-A-G-E, -E, fuselage. Good morning. Calypso. Calypso. This word is from Greek, right? Are you asking me a minute? This word is from a Greek name. Yeah. Definition, please. A ballad-like improvisation of African rhythm, usually sat satirizing current events, first composed and sung in competition in the British West Indies. <sighs> Let's see, Calypso. Calypso. C-A-L-Y-P-S- Oh, Calypso. Debacle. Debacle. D-E-B-A-C-L-E. -E. Debacle. We're going to skip the next one. This word could be confused with a similar word. Hyperbole. It is a noun. And its definition is extravagant exaggeration that represents something as much greater or less, better or worse, or more intense than it really is, or that depicts the impossible as actual. Language of origin, please. This word is from Greek. Hyperbole. H-Y-P-E-R-B-O-L-E. -E. Hyperbole. Alkali. Alkali. A L C A L I. Alkali. The, print, the correct spelling is A L K A L I. Springla. Can you repeat that? Springla. May I have the definition? This word is from originally German word. Can I have the definition? Certainly. A thick, thick hard cookie, usually flavored with anise and impressed with a relief sick design and traditionally eaten at Christmas in German speaking countries. Springla. S P R I N G O L A. Springla. Mesmerize. M E S M E R I Z E. Mesmerize. Dipha. Dipha? Uh, can you give me the language of origin, please? This word is from an Arabic word. Okay. 
Difa. D I F F A. Difa. Trotteria. Can you repeat that? Trotteria. Trotteria. Can <coughs> Can you give me language of origin? This word is originally French, but passed through Italian before becoming English. And definition? An eating house, a restaurant. Okay. Can you use it in a sentence? One of the delights of touring Rome is finding an uncrowded trattoria. T-R-A-U-T-E-R-I-A, -E trattoria. The correct spelling is T-R-A-T-T-O-R-I-A. -T -T Charlatan. Charlatan. C-H-A-R-L-A-T-A-N. Qatari. Qatari. Q-A-T-A-R-I. Qatari. Halal. Can you repeat the word, please? Halal. Can you give me the origin? This word is from Arabic. Halal. H-A-L-A-L. -A -L. Halal. Punctilio. Uh, can you repeat that? Punctilio. Uh, can I have derivation, please? This word is from a word that went from Latin to Spanish to Italian. Uh, can you use it in a sentence? Tim's parents strictly enforced the punctilio that his guests remove their shoes before entering the family's house. Can I have a definition? A point of behavior about which one is fastidious. Can you repeat that one more time? A point of behavior about which one is fastidious. Can you repeat the word? Oh, certainly. Punctilio. Punctilio. P-U-N-C-T-I-L-I-O. Punctilio. Capricious. Capricious. C A P R I C I U S. The correct spelling is C A P R I C I O U S. Misogynist. Misogynist. M I S O G Y N I S T. Misogynist. Embarcadero. Could you use the word in a sentence, please? An organ, an organ grinder and his monkey entertained visitors at the Embarcadero at the, of the restored village. Can I please have the definition? A landing place, especially. A landing place on an island waterway as a navigable screen. Can I have the language of origin, please? This word is from a word that went from Latin to Spanish. Could you repeat the word, please? Embarcadero. Could you repeat it again? Embarcadero. E M B A R G O D A R R O W, Embargadero.
The correct spelling is E-M-B-A-R-C-A-D-E-R-O. Commensurate. Can you say that again? Commensurate. C O M M Okay, C O M N E N S O R A T E. The correct spelling is C O M M E N S U R A T E. And we're going to the next round. Or it's the same round, okay. I'm sorry, I was missing my spot. Conquistador. Conquistador. C O N Q U I S T A D O R. Conquistador. This word could be confused with a similar word. The word is Meiji. It is an adjective, and its definition is of relating to or having the characteristics of the period of the reign of the Japanese emperor Matsuhito. Could I have the language of origin? This word is from Japanese. Could you repeat the word? Meiji. Meiji. M-E-I-J-I. Meiji. Skipper key. Can I have a definition, please? A dog of a Belgian breed of small, stocky black dogs with foxy head and erect triangular ears, developed originally chiefly for use as a watchdog on can canal boats. Can I have the language of origin, please? This word is from a Dutch word that went into Flemish. Can I have a sentence, please? Andrew named his skipper key Captain. Skipper key. S C H I. P. P E R K E, Skipper Key. Hi. Detente. Detente. Definition, please. Certainly. A slackening or relaxing, especially. An easing or relaxation of strained relations and political tensions between nations. Uh, language of origin? This word came from French, which formed it from a Latin word. Mm. Sentence, please. The 1970s were a period of detente between the United States and the Soviet Union. All right. Detente. D E T E N T E. Sauerbraten. S A U E R B R A T E N. Balalaika. Language of origin, please. This word is from Russian. Balalaika. B A L A. L A I K A. Balalaika. Word. 
The word is Madeline. It is a noun, and it is a s small, rich cake baked in a tin shaped like a shell. Um, can you provide the language of origin? This word is from a French name. Um, Madeline. M-A-D-E-L-I-N-E. -E, Madeline. The correct spelling is M-A-D-E-L-E-I-N-E. -E. Kielbasa. Kielbasa. Can I have the definition, please? An uncooked smoked sausage. In the language of origin? This word is from a Polish name. Kielbasa. K-I-E-L-B-A-S-A. -E Kielbasa. Mirub. Could you repeat the word? Mirub. 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 Could I have the language of origin? This word is from Arabic. M I R O B. The correct spelling is M I H R A B. Anschluss. Anschluss. A N C H L U S S. Anschluss. Is A N S C H L U S S. This word has a homonym. The word is fate. It is a verb, and its definition is honor a person or commemorate an event with a festive celebration. Can you repeat the word, please? Fate. Fate. F A T E, fate. The correct spelling is F-E-T-E. -E. This word has a near homonym. The word is vedal. It is a verb, and its definition is ski downhill by moving the rear of one's skis from side to side, making a series of short, quick turns while following the fall line. Can you repeat the word? Vedal. Um, can I have the derivation? This word is from an originally German word. Can you repeat that one more time? The word? The, the definition or the? The word. I mean the word. Vedal. Vedal. V A D E L. Vedal. The correct spelling is W E D E L. Pogrom. Pogrom. P O G R O M. Pogrom. Mukhtar. Can I have the language of origin? This word is from an Arabic word. Can I have the definition? The head of the local government of a town. Mukhtar. M U K T A H R. Mukhtar. The correct spelling is M U K H T A R. Vaccaro. Could you repeat the word? Vaccaro. Could it have the language of origin, please? This word is from Spanish. Vaccaro. V-A-Q-U-E-R-O. Vaccaro. Tokamak. Can I have a definition, please? 
a toroidal device for producing controlled nuclear fusion that involves the confining and heating of a gaseous plasma by means of an internal electric current and its attendant magnetic field. Could I have the language of origin, please? This word is from Russia, or Russian. Could I have a sentence, please? The Russian tokamak is part of the international project for creation of the world's first industrial thermonuclear reactor. Could you repeat the word, please? Tokamak. Tokamak. T O. K A M A K. Tokamak. Hi. This word could be confused with a similar word. Mine her. It is a noun, and it, its definition is Mr used as a title pre prefix to the name of a male Netherlander or Dutch-speaking man. Okay, mine her. Mine her? Mine her. Are there any alternate pronunciations for that? Mine her. Mine her. Mine hair. M Y N H E E R, mine hair. Fogara. Definition. An underground conduit for water in desert country, des I'm sorry, desert country, as in the Sahara. F-O-G-G-A-R-A. -A. This word has a homonym. The word is Balu. It is a noun. It is a common bear of India or Sri Lanka that has long black hair and very large claws, a white v-neck mark on the breast, a long snout, and a very mobile tongue and lips. Language of origin, please. This word is a word that went from Sanskrit to Hindi. Balu. B-H-A-L-U. Balu. This word has a homonym. The word is spitz. It is a noun, and the definition is a medium-sized white dog descended from Pomeranian ancestors and often regarded as constituting a separate breed. Spitz. S-P-I-T-Z. Spitz. This word has a homonym. The word is spoor. It is a noun. It is a mark, and the definition is a mark as a footprint, a trail, a scent, a sound, or droppings left by one as a wild animal that has passed. Can you repeat the word? Spoor. Can you repeat it louder? Spoor. S'more? Spoor. 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 S P O O R. Monsoon. Could you repeat the word? Monsoon. Could I have the language of origin? This word is from an originally Arabic word that went through Port Portuguese and then Dutch before becoming English. Could you repeat the word? Monsoon. 
monsoon. M O N S O O N, monsoon. Hustle. Could I have the language of origin, please? This word is from a Dutch word. Could I have the definition, please? The definition is move or act with a vigorous speed. Could I have a sentence, please? If you hustle, you can make your train, Betty shouted. Are there any homonyms? Not listed. Hustle. H-U-S-T-L-E, hustle. Hi there. Easel. Easel. Definition, please. A wooden, metal, or plastic frame to hold a canvas upright or inclined at a proper level for the painter's convenience in working. Easel. Oh, my. Uh, part of speech, please. It is a noun. Mm, language of origin. This word is from a Dutch word. Mm. Sentence, please. The artist set up his easel in the garden and started to depict the colorful flowers. Easel. E A S E L. Easel. This word has a homonym. The word is cashew. It is a noun, and its definition is the kidney-shaped nut of a tropical American tree naturalized in all warm countries. Cashew, C-A-S-H-E-W. This word has a near homonym. The word is protein. It is a noun. And the definition is any of a very large class of naturally occurring, extremely complex combinations of amino acids that are essential constituents of all living cells and also of the diet of the animal organism. Language of origin, please. This word is from a Greek-derived French element plus an international scientific vocabulary element. Protein. P-R-O-T-E-I-N. Protein. After two and a half hours of spelling and 54 eliminated contestants, one seventh grader came out on top. Harold Harmon, a student from East Muskingum Middle School, spelled exacerbate to take home the win. After his win at the Scripps College of Communication Regional Spelling Bee, he will be headed to the National Spelling Bee.